Hello today's video we have the following content. Dialogue with Zhang Han, the lead actor of Only Green, on stage, I am Zai Meng. More than 900 years ago in the Northern Song Dynasty, the talented young man Zai Meng painted 8,000 miles of rivers and mountains on a 12-meter long scroll. Today, more than 900 years later, the young dancer Zhang Han uses dance to lead the audience into Zai Meng's spiritual world. The persistent pursuit of art is the common point between Zai Meng and Zhang Han. They have spent nearly 20 years focusing on one thing, one is painting and the other is dancing. In 2020, the dance poem Only Green, inspired by the famous Northern Song Dynasty painting A Thousand Miles of Rivers and Mountains, was launched. Zhang Han stood out among many dancers and played the role of Zai Meng, a talented painter in the Northern Song Dynasty. In 2022, the play became popular through the CCTV Spring Festival Gala stage, and tickets were hard to come by wherever the tour went. In the 2024 National Day, the movie Only Green became the highest rated film in the same period with a dub and score of 8.0, and Zhang Han was also known and loved by more people. On October 9, the 600th performance of Only Green was held in Guangzhou. Zhang Han on the stage was still the free and lively young man. Zhang Han is Zai Mang this is the audience's evaluation. Zhang Han, who graduated from the National Folk Dance Department of Beijing Dance Academy, was called the all-crown dancer and the undefeated dancer because of his legendary experience of never taking second place in professional dance competitions. He is currently a young dancer of China Oriental Performing Arts Group. During the tour, Zhang Han said in an exclusive interview with Nandu Entertainment that the whole play actually runs through Zai Mang's different ages. In the process, there is the liveliness of the youth, the frustration and tenacity of several paintings have been presented, but not very good, and the talent and acquired research of the youth. The most important thing is not to interpret the genius side of Zai Meng, but to interpret every side of him as a person. He said. Zhang Han off the stage is a passionate person. He speaks fast, dances with his hands, and has a very cheerful and lively personality. Occasionally, he would say something like enough or some ancient style words, or utter an ancient poem like people today cannot see the moon of the ancient times, but the moon today once shone on the ancients. When talking about Zai Meng, Zhang Han's eyes are always bright and he has endless things to say. Nando Entertainment, when casting, were there many dancers competing for Zai Meng? Zhang Han, of course, including me and my colleagues, we probably all wanted to play Zai Meng. Our group has a good atmosphere, and we learn together whatever we want to play. We learned all the movements and dance segments together, and then we decided on the roles. The director also maintained a fair attitude, and whoever performed well would play. Finally, three people were decided to play Zai Meng, divided into three groups, A, B, C. I belonged to group A, and I played the first performance. Later, groups B and C also started to play, which was a kind of mentoring. I am a little older, and I am their elder brother. I will tell them my experience, and they will pass it on one by one. Whoever wants to learn can learn together, and whoever learns well will play, which is pretty good. Nando Entertainment, being selected among many dancers to play the leading male roles I men, what do you think is your advantage? Zhang Han, I was young at that time, just in my early twenties. My height, image, and some body movements were more like a teenager. In addition, my personality is also optimistic and cheerful, which is exactly the same as Zai Meng. Nando Entertainment, was it stressful to take on the heavy responsibility of being the protagonist of a dance drama at such a young age? Zhang Han, it was very stressful. The whole team worked together for half a year. If I, as the leading male in the play, couldn't hold on, it might negate our collective efforts. So this pressure does not come from myself, but from the entire crew. Everyone hopes that this play will be recognized after it is rehearsed, just like Zai Mang's painting A Thousand Miles of Rivers and Mountains, hoping to be recognized by his teacher. I have the same mentality as Zai Meng. I know I can do it, so I have to work hard. There will definitely be pressure, but after withstanding the pressure, I found that it is actually nothing. Young people will become stronger and stronger in their hearts if they try their best and take on responsibilities. Nando Entertainment in order to polish the 8,000 miles of rivers and mountains on the stage and acquire the true Song Dynasty temperament, the crew also invited experts to teach the dancers. What do they learn in this process? For example, there are seal carvers, silk weavers, stone grinders, pen makers, ink makers, etc. in the play. Through learning and understanding, what kind of spirit do you experience from craftsmen? Zhang Han, 
At that time, we learned from many intangible cultural heritage teachers in the rehearsal hall, which I think is very useful. When we first rehearsed this play, we knew that part of the content was about craftsmen. We only knew that it was not easy for them and they only did one thing in their lives, but we didn't know the craftsman's process. For example, pen making, I saw the process of pen making. A couple came. The husband was responsible for getting bamboo poles, grinding holes for bamboo poles, selecting bamboo poles of the same proportion, and picking hair, his wife kept soaking her hands in water to make all the hairs even. When she took her hands out, they were already swollen. It was not soaked for one or two days, but for years. She operated and worked in the water for a long time, and her hands were swollen. There are more than 80 processes in making pens, and each process needs to be completed little by little. This cannot be done in one or two days. There is also the Chinese painting pigment teacher Qiuqi Nian, who is nearly 80 years old. He demonstrated to us step by step on the stage how to grind the pigment, grind it into powder, how much water to pour, and what is the ratio of first grain, second grain, and third grain. His eyes are full of light and love for the career in his hands. At that moment, you are very moved by their spirit. They have been conscientiously doing one thing all their lives. Just like what our play says, I would like to pay tribute to the excellent traditional Chinese culture and its creators and inheritors with this play, their selfless dedication is very moving. They don't ask for anything, they just hope to pass on this craft from generation to generation. Nando Entertainment, you will also do some field trips, right? Zhang Han, field trips are my own. I play a painter in the play. I think if I want to interpret this role well, I still have to go into Zai Meng's heart. Only when you see it in person can you move it to the stage, just like Zai Meng, only when you see it can you move it to your own painting. 8,000 miles of rivers and mountains is 1,191.5 cm long and 51.5 cm wide. All the characters in it are painted vividly. Not only are there magnificent scenes, but if you cut each layout, it is a painting that can stand alone. There are small bridges, flowing water, and houses. There are bridges in turbulent streams. When the waterfall comes down, it is very turbulent when it just falls down. There will be whirlpools when it flows back, and it slowly becomes calm from far to near. Every water ripple is painted so meticulously and methodically. He must have visited the local area and could not rely entirely on imagination, so it is very necessary to collect folk songs. Nando Entertainment, the dancer and the painter are one moving and the other quiet. Do you think you and Zai Meng have anything in common? Zhang Han, it is rumored that Zai Meng left this world in his early twenties. I am also in my twenties now. Maybe Zai Meng has not lived to my age. But I have been dancing for more than twenty years, doing only this one thing. I believe Zai Meng has also been doing one thing for twenty years, that is, how to paint well, and how I dance well. He hopes that his work can be recognized by his teacher, that he can draw a work that satisfies himself and everyone, and that a work can be left behind, I also hope that I can have one or several dance works that can be recognized by everyone and passed down to future generations. Our starting point is the same, we are all people who work hard for art. Nando Entertainment, no film or stage work has ever performed or recorded a young man's eye man before. How do you find the feeling of this role and how do you grasp the charm of a genius painter? Zhang Han, I started by reading books every day. I read a lot of books, from history to Chinese painting to aesthetics, to some well-known painters analyzing the character and personality of Zai Meng. Then I went to the rehearsal room to polish it with the directors, and often locked myself in the rehearsal room until midnight. I imagine that the boy more than 900 years ago was also alone in the dead of night, holding a pen, outlining every water ripple in every line. I also practiced every movement over and over again. He may have practiced each line tens of thousands of times, and I may have practiced each movement thousands of times. Nando Entertainment, later on, you also specifically looked for a teacher to learn painting. What did you gain from the learning process? Did it help you shape your character? Zhang Han, I specifically found a teacher to learn to copy a thousand miles of rivers and mountains. At first, I wanted to learn green landscaped painting, but later I thought it would be more direct to copy just like I copied every brush stroke of Zai Meng. I am now painting step by step where Zai Meng painted in the past, I am also walking step by step where Zai Meng walked. Sometimes when I go out to collect folk songs, I wonder if Zai Meng was standing on this hilltop and looking at the scenery in the distance more than 900 years ago and standing in the same place with me and seeing this beautiful land of the motherland. 
so it is not that you can achieve it in one go by playing a character. You have to communicate with his soul and inner thoughts little by little. You have to know what he does every day, what makes him happy and what makes him sad, just like the inscription of Keijing, the Prime Minister of the Northern Song Dynasty, Zai Meng was 18 years old. He was a student in the painting school. He was summoned to the Forbidden Library and presented several paintings, but they were not very good. From these few sentences, we can know that he was once a student in the painting academy and later worked as a clerk in the library. Song Huzong thought that this child was very talented and could teach him to paint, but every time he handed in his homework or works to the teacher and wanted the teacher to help him look at them, the teacher was not satisfied every time. He presented several paintings that were not very good. Why? In fact, there is a day when geniuses are not recognized, which shows that he not only has a genius side, but also has an unknown hardworking side behind the scenes. Isn't it the same for everyone? I believe that not everyone has a smooth sailing, and has experienced praise and criticism to a certain extent, but it doesn't matter, he is still so young. For me, the most important thing is not to interpret the genius side of Zai Meng, but to interpret every side of him. Nando Entertainment what are the difficulties in interpreting a painter with dance? For example, is it a bit difficult to present his spiritual world? Zhang Han, I think it is not difficult to interpret a painter. I interpret a painter who has no historical records. It is like I tell you that there is a person named Li Si and ask you to play this character. How to play it? Is this person a man or a woman, and how old is he? You don't know. Zai Meng, you know that he is an 18-year-old boy who painted a thousand miles of rivers and mountains. He used to be a student in the painting academy, and later worked as a civil servant. Every time he presented a painting to the emperor, the emperor was not satisfied. Later, he spent half a year to finish the painting, and the emperor was satisfied. There is no such person in history. How to bring a person who really existed in history but has few records to the stage to meet every audience is the most difficult point, and it is also the point that the director pays the most. Directors often say that we can't make up a love story for Zai Meng and fool the audience, which is sorry for Zai Meng. In addition, how to interpret the diversity of teenagers is also a difficult point. At the beginning, I was probably more like a teenager in terms of my body movements, and the dance movements I choreographed were more like the spirit and nature of a teenager, but was I a teenager in my heart? So I often went out to look around, run around, climb mountains, look at water, look at animals, and look at people because painters are good at observation, and their eyes are like cameras, they want to capture some beautiful things and go back to paint them on their silk. So he must be a teenager who was full of fun and full of expectations and longings for life. Because his 8,000 miles of rivers and mountains is vivid, with scenes of farmers working, fishing, rowing, washing clothes, drinking tea, and two tea boys sitting next to them. The mountains are high and low, and the trees are so big in some places and so small in others. There are also masks for boats and water wheels. Through this painting, we can see how much he loves life, but the fact that his paintings are not very well done also shows that he is not so recognized, so he has a kind of energy in his heart, the kind of energy of a teenager who refuses to admit defeat. If you say I can't do it, I must be able to do it. For example, there is a character called the roller in the play. The roller can always see Zai Meng, but Zai Meng can never see the roller. However, Zai Meng knows that there is such a person who has been silently accompanying him. How should this psychological state be developed? Many viewers said that they were moved when they saw the roller put clothes on Zai Meng. Zhang Han, right? I was also moved. When I really regarded myself as Zai Meng, when the clothes were really put on me, at that moment I felt that someone was silently supporting me behind me. This kind of touching feeling is like when you are at the bottom of your life. Your parents send you a WeChat message saying come on, son, it's okay. Everyone is like this, and will be moved for a long time because of a little warmth. It is more difficult for you to make a talented and hardworking teenager come alive on the stage. Nando Entertainment, in addition to the part where the roller put clothes on Zai Meng, what other scenes in the play touched you and what dance segments do you like? Zhang Han, I like many scenes in the play very much, including the solo dance in the rain, entering the painting and the Hanlin Academy of Painting. Among them, I like the part where Zai Meng dances alone in the rain the most. In that part, every part of Zai Meng's body is a pen, the head is a pen, the hand is a pen, the elbow is a pen, the knee is a pen, the foot is a pen, the earth and the sky are paper and scrolls, and my body is a pen, writing and painting between heaven and earth. 
Every time I dance that dance, it is very refreshing and hearty. Because I am a child from Hubei, I remember that it rained every week when I was a child. It happened to be on weekends or after school. I would wear boots and go out to step on water and get wet in the rain. I would come back to give my parents a beating and change clothes. When it rains, everyone may be anxious to take shelter from the rain, including me now. I may open an umbrella, or quickly find a place to take shelter from the rain or take a taxi. I will not enjoy walking in the rain and feeling the raindrops falling on every inch of my skin. I don't have this time now, I don't have this leisure time, I still have to perform. What if I catch a cold and have a fever and can't dance? How can I live up to the audience? Now I have a lot of burdens on my shoulders, which young people don't have. Nando Entertainment, in the part of entering the painting, I saw you crying a lot. Zhang Han, that part is when Zimang really finished a thousand miles of rivers and mountains. At that moment, I laughed and cried, but more often I laugh with tears. I laugh because I finally finished the painting, I cried because I felt that Zimang was too tired. He finished the painting in less than half a year. I don't know if you understand this concept. Anyway, I went to learn painting at that time, and I learned for six hours a day. I only painted a little bit each time, and I was still in the state of not coloring. I felt dizzy and couldn't straighten my waist. Think about the 12 meter long scroll. He drew the draft once, outlined the mountain shape once, and applied ochre color once. He painted the same painting five times in less than half a year. There was no light more than 900 years ago, right? At night, he used a candle and a thin brush to paint little by little. There was no heating in the winter in ancient times, so he couldn't even hold a pen. I feel very tired when I perform every day, not to mention that he painted so many paintings in less than half a year. You can imagine how much pressure he was under, so I prefer to believe that he knew that his body was about to fail when he was painting or when he finished the painting, but he felt it was worth it. This is my guess and my understanding. When I jump into the painting, I sometimes laugh, and I will cry while laughing. His mood is very complicated. It is not easy for Xi Meng. He worked hard and finally painted it. That moment is worth it. If he knew that this painting could be admired by future generations, he must feel that his first half of his life was happy and complete. If I have a dance work that can last for hundreds of years, or 100 years, my life will be worth it. People who engage in art are like this. Who doesn't want to have a good work that will be passed down to future generations? Nando Entertainment, I remember there was a scene where Zai Meng was painting late at night, constantly painting and rubbing and starting over. That part particularly touched me. As a literary and artistic worker, have you ever experienced loneliness, lack of affirmation, and being trapped like Zai Meng? Have you ever had a moment of self-doubt? Zhang Han, of course. I think it is rare to be recognized by everyone and not fall into self-doubt. Most of the time, it is self-doubt. If you want to have a good work of art, you have to constantly break yourself. Like I have performed hundreds of shows now, sometimes I still break myself. Today's state is not right, or I feel that I have physical problems today, and I did not show the most explosive side or the most contagious emotions to the audience. I will also ask myself, is today's performance the most perfect? If not, go back and summarize, and show everyone a better state in the next show. We emphasize being consistent in hundreds of shows, entering self-doubt and constantly denying ourselves, so that we can produce good works. Nando Entertainment, when I see you playing Zimin on stage, I feel that you're Zimin. Zhang Han, I think so too, because I think of myself as Zimin when I am on stage. Nando Entertainment, how do you do it? Is Zimin's soul already in your body? Zhang Han, I think sometimes yes. When performing on stage, your mind may be completely empty at a certain moment, or you may be completely immersed in the state of the character. The light in your eyes and the body movements may be different from my usual self. Maybe at that moment I really became Zimin on the stage. It is very important to become Zimin. Whether you can do it depends on how sincere your heart is. I respect this traditional culture and admire Zimin, the talented boy. I hope to be him on stage. As an actor, I think it is necessary to perform a role well on stage. You only eat this bowl of rice. If you can't perform well, you will be ashamed of this profession, right? When performing a dance drama, not only the body and limbs must be like this person, but also the demeanor and expression must be like this person. I have to live up to my conscience, this profession, and the audience friends who paid for tickets. It is necessary to become Zimming on stage. Nando Entertainment, you have played the same role so many times, are you still so passionate? How to maintain it? 
Zhang Han, enthusiasm will definitely fade, but you have to keep looking for something new to fill your heart. For example, I especially like to watch some cultural programs, such as National Treasure in China in Classics. Watching these programs will give me some spiritual food, which will make me respect culture more when I perform. Including I like to go out and take a look. Every time I perform in a place, if I have a break, I will go to see the local scenery and learn about humanities in history, such as the Westlake in Hangzhou, the gardens in Suzhou, the terracotta warriors in Xi'an, and the museums in Henan. I will go if I can. I think standing there to feel the great mountains and rivers of the motherland is the same as the feeling of inner surging when I perform Zimang looking at the great mountains and rivers of the Song Dynasty on the stage. Nando Entertainment, how do you think Zimang, an 18-year-old genius painter more than 900 years ago, can impress today's young people? Zhang Han, today's young people love Chinese traditional culture very much. We can see many audiences wearing ancient costumes in the theater to watch only green and young parents are also willing to bring their children to watch the performance. Now we are talking about cultural confidence. As director Han Zhen said, you have to know where you come from and identify with where you come from. This is very important. So you see that many young people are willing to spend time, energy and money to come to the theater to watch a performance about Chinese traditional culture. It is already worth it. When I was a child, my major was Chinese folk dance, which is also the inheritance of Chinese traditional culture. When I was a child, I often went to collect folk songs. Every time we went to a place, the most common thing that the local old artist said was that no one passed on these things of ours. The children all went out to work. They felt that folk dance was rustic. The old artist said, I really don't know. When our generation is gone, what will happen if this thing is gone? My eyes were red at the time. He was not thinking about himself, but this dance. When their generation leaves this world and takes it away, no one will know it. It's a pity. Chinese traditional culture has been so precious for thousands of years, and our generation should carry it on their shoulders. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 